I'd really like to know is, this, is if this really used to be a pop bottle and how it got here and whether or not any BASF products were used to get it around our necks. Um, for those of you who aren't familiar with us, BASF is the chemical company, that's our brand. We're the world's largest chemical company. Globally, we have 95,000 employees, over 15,000 employees in North America, uh, over a billion dollars in sales in Canada alone, and over 550 employees in Canada. What do we do? Perhaps you've seen our slogan, which is, we don't make the products you buy, we make the products you buy better, which doesn't really tell you a lot about the industries we're in. But one of the industries we're in is textiles. The indigo blue dye is ours, which is why we don't understand why they won't let us wear jeans to work. Uh, we're in the automobile business. We make um, coatings that I'll tell you a little bit more about in a few minutes. It used to be mostly solvent-borne, but are now becoming waterborne with our in increased sensitivity to the environment and sustainability issues. We're in the construction industry with insulating products, roofing materials and construction chemicals, agriculture with crop protection products and also oil and gas. So that gives you sort of the broad range of what we do. And how do we operate? We have four pillars under which we operate. One of them is to ensure sustainable development. The other three are forming the best team, earning a premium on our cost of capital and making our customers more successful. But in terms of the ensuring sustainability and ensuring sustainable development, part of our high performance organization targets is to make sure that each of our employees has a sustainability objective in what they're supposed to do every year. So it's a focus on making sure everyone understands the importance of sustainability and sustainable development and cascading that down throughout the organization to all employees so that they all know that they have a role to play, just as all of us in society have a role to play, but that our employees have a role to play in ensuring sustainable development. In fact, we have a mandatory training tool online for sustainable development that each of our employees in Canada was, um, was obligated to do last year. So how does BASF live sustainable development? This is not at all a new concept for BASF. We've looked at ensuring sustainable development